Not the burn? Yeah, yeah. yeah. burnt out, yeah, no, huh? Not That's yet. good. You can go with, um, that just seems to be kind of a buzz about uh, Rush every last and says you know, you're going to be able to handle it. This season seemed like you had no offseason. How do you feel? Yeah, I feel good. I mean, right now, at the, at the moment, I think we're all sore um, after all these practices, but I think uh, I'll be fine by the season. I mean, just playing basketball, what I love to do. So every time I get a chance, I, uh, I like to lay down or recover, but I mean, I'm, I'm fine. And most people think that uh, if you put on 20 pounds, it's a bad thing for you. It's a good thing. Oh, yeah, it's uh, a good thing. How, 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 how do you do it? How do you feel? Uh, I mean, I gained uh, a lot of weight before I left for Colorado Springs to uh, play on Team USA. But uh, once I got over there, I kind of lost that weight. Um, the food we ate wasn't great. I was playing basketball the whole time. So it's hard to maintain it. But once I got back, I think I put on another five. So I think I did a good job with that. And I feel really good this year. In what ways do you think that I'd experience on Team USA? Uh, I think I, I played against some really good players over there. Uh, the, the guys I played against uh, were really physical. Uh, the refs were not really calling much, so I had, to, I had to learn my ways. I shot a lot of threes over there, but I think I uh, learned to face up more against those guys, the more physical guys. Last year I was more of a back-to-the-basket guy in the Valley. This year I think I can carry more of that uh, face-up game. So that's how that helped out. Uh, uh, I mean, just rebounding. Uh, sometimes you get stronger guys, you just really can't do much about it. Uh, uh, and then just getting on the block, too. I mean, I'm sure there will be some guys uh, being really physical to me, possibly on the team. So I uh, just got to be able to fight through that. Uh, teammates. But I uh, think just strength uh, defensively will really help me as well. I talked to your dad, and he said that this, the ceiling has no limit. You're not even close to your ceiling. What, what can you um, I think I can improve on a lot of things. My defense is definitely uh, the main concern right now. I'm just trying to get quicker lateral. Uh, but uh, I think my game has a lot of improve. I can improve a lot of things. I can get a lot better. Uh, my three-point shot uh, needs to get more consistent. Those are the main things I'm going to focus on. Yeah, part of me is a little surprised, but uh, I was just given a really good opportunity, and uh, I had to make the most of it, and I think I worked really hard uh, going into the last season, and I think that carried over into this offseason. I just wanted to work hard, so man, I can make it even more special. A lot of people are saying that you guys probably be the favorite. Yeah. Uh, you know, coming off of last year, how do you feel like you guys have handled that label? Um, I mean, it's a good honor. I mean, we like that uh, people are starting to give us a recognition. But uh, once the game starts, I mean, we still got to play the season. We got to put all that stuff uh, beside us, and we got to go out there and perform. And it all starts right now um, during these practices. What do you think of the Valley this year? I mean, I think it's good. I mean, a lot of good guys returning. Uh, I mean, some of the some of the other teams lost a lot of guys, but I think Indiana State and Wichita State will be our main rivals. And, I mean, there's some good teams out there and some good players, so uh, it, should be a, it should be an exciting season for the fans. How often do you think about the NCAA? Uh, I think about it I think every time I step on the court. Step on the court. Um, I know Creighton hasn't been there since 2007. Uh, I know the fans are just waiting for it. So we got to do uh, whatever it takes to get there. I mean, it just all starts here. We're working hard work and um, being able to everyone know the roles and it just takes everyone else a whole has to know, has to, has to be on the same page. You know, yeah, looking back at uh, the experience you had in this whole season, obviously it wasn't determined you wanted to be here. But in, in, in the long run, it's a good blessing because you had like an extra couple weeks of practice, you had all those games, and game series, and all that stuff. Yeah, I mean, I think that was a, definitely a positive for us. I mean, at the time, not a lot of us wanted to do it because it wasn't the term we wanted to play. But, uh, I think looking back on it now, I think uh, we learned a lot from it. I know VCU actually won the CBI and they made their final four run. So Missouri State really benefited, benefited from playing in the CIT, I believe. So I think it's just only going to help. Thank you, sir.